Welcome back to Play the Game HQ. I'm Daniel, this is Allison, and today we are previewing Disney Kingdomania from Funko Games, who sponsor this video, and Allison is going to tell us about Kingdomania. Kingdomania, you are assortment of Disney characters from random Disney movies. I think we've got about seven yeah. movies currently that they're pulling from. Yes, you are Thank gamified. You. you are gamified. So you are the game avatars of the characters mm -hmm. in these films. And you are in a video game, but there are glitches in your game. Mm -hmm. So collectively, you are going together around your video game to try to find your patches to put them on the Nexus to stop the glitches. Yes. Now this is a one to however many characters you have. This is an expandable game, so you can add balls or boxes to add more characters if you want more players to come and play with you. Yep. Now Disney Kingdomania comes in two different forms. It comes in the Super Game Pack box or in the ball. Now to play Kingdomania, each player is going to need two characters or a character and an item and 10 level cards. That is what is in the game balls. There are two different characters and 10 level cards in this ball. And then the Super Game Pack box has six figurines. It's gonna be four characters and two items and then enough level cards for two players. And the levels are set up randomly every game. So you're gonna set out your Nexus and then shuffle the other nine cards and randomly put them out connecting entryways to other matching cards. And then you are going to be moving around your level trying to push the patches to the Nexus and keep the glitch tiles away from the Nexus. And the really cool thing about this is that, again, each player is going to set up their own level. So it starts out as a little bit of a solo game where you're kind of trying to deal with your level, but you can use these warp spaces. There's one there and there's one there mm -hmm. to warp between levels. So if Allison gets in a bind or there's a glitch that's about to get to her Nexus that she can't get to fast enough, I can warp over on my turn to her level and we can help each other out. And it really was, the gameplay is really simple. It was more- It was challenging. It was more challenging than I expected it to be when we played. Again, this is obviously targeted at a younger or at a family audience, mm -hmm. uh, but it was, it was really fun. We had a good time playing it. The boys loved it and it was, <laughs> but it was more challenging than it appears with, with what you get. Now you're seeing a few different characters and items here. There's a difference between the balls and the boxes. In the balls, that's when you get those special glitch characters. Mm -hmm. They're like blue and yellow or an orange. So and we don't have any of those We don't have here. any of those yet. That's why these are a surprise. You mm -hmm. don't know what you're gonna get. There's also a surprise in here. You get the items from the box. You don't get the glitch characters in the box, but you do get the items. So like here we have the Aladdin's lamp and we've got the donut from Zootopia. So that's really fun to be able to mix and match. These remind me of, we grew up with Wonderball. Yes. So this kind of has that has like that, has Wonderball that feel, feel, which I, nostalgia, I love, plus yes. also the movies that I love. That and there, there is some surprise in what you get. So the expandable or the, the super game pack, it has Maleficent's dragon. There's a couple of different kinds of Maleficent's dragons you can get, but those are visible. And then there's the hidden characters. You don't know what you're gonna get. It's a surprise character. And then up here in the top of the box is the items. So mm -hmm. each box you get is a surprise. There may be some overlap. You may have some repeated characters, but that's okay because you're going to play with multiple levels. Even as a solo game, you can set up multiple levels yeah. and, and play it to make it a little more challenging or to make it a little bit longer game. But this is Disney's Kingdomania. We are going to have a full playthrough and a full tutorial of this. We're gonna get the boys in here. We're gonna play a game of it as a family. We're going to try to save our video game world before we get glitched. And then they're doing a tutorial also. We will leave links to those below when we have mm -hmm. that. But yeah, this is a, obviously the figures are adorable. It's gonna be fun to try and <laughs> so get all fun. of them. They're just fun. There's a lot of nostalgia in the game. I like the- They sit on the, the video. Yes, they do. I like the video gamified world of it. And then just, again, each character has different abilities that they can use. There's, that's right. Yeah, there's some good strategy for a family weight game, for a, a game that's gonna be accessible for younger kids and for families to play together. Um, there's some good, just some good elements to it that we really enjoyed. Yeah, I have, I really, really like So we'll, yeah, yeah, we'll leave links below where you can check this out as well as our tutorial and our playthrough. Yep. So we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.